All right, guys, we are back at the $230 steal is what I've been calling it. So we got a table set up. We are, it's really dark inside of the unit, so we brought our O-lights. Uh, if you haven't checked out O-light, the link is down in the comments. I did make a mistake. I thought you got 10% off sale items, but you don't. So that was the mistake. But you always get 10% off, period. So if you like any of these items, if you do storage units, and you buy units, you know what I'm talking about. There's no light in the hallway. There's no light. Uh, in the unit so I brought O lights because all the O lights are magnet and you can stick them anywhere so I brought three oh did she already get them she already got them so I got three O lights to bring we're gonna put them in there so we have a little bit more light y'all but I think that we, again we're three boxes no two boxes into this unit so let's see if we can find some more gold older baseball cards more points so I brought my pocket knife. I even brought gloves today, y'all. I'm feeling pretty good this morning. All right, y'all, this is one of the newest products that's out. I don't know if these are still sold out, but these are the O-bulbs. I'm gonna show you why I like O-lights. Um, but look, it comes with a recharger. Look. So cool. I so I think I'm gonna buy a few more of these for mm -hmm. these units, because watch, I did figure it out after I did the video. So you hold it down for the first level, second, goes red, red. does a strobe light. In case you want to get your party on, you know what I mean? <laughs> so look how dark it is in here. But well, watch this. Ugh. So I can take my O-light, right? Stick it up there. Uh, will you hand me the brass flash? Or no, give me the little red one, the new one. All right, y'all, that's a little bit softer light. I like that. These are a little bit brighter. But look, this is the one that comes with the docking. The rechargeable, like, iPod. This is not a video. I'm not making money on this, on this video, y'all. <laughs> I'm just showing you that like, look, you know what I mean? So like, look how dark it is in here now. And I could actually, let's see. Yeah, I think there's a second level brighter one for the oval. Yeah, so look, I can even stick these on walls or like this, look, boom. So it kind of gets the back of the unit, ah. you know, like that. But look, they're all magnetized. I bought three of them uh, just because I thought, it would give it, look at that it gives us a little bit more a little bit more light so y'all i'm telling you o lights like for this business it's the bomb.com because everything's freaking made out of metal and you literally can put i have big flashlight that will light up this whole freaking room like 10 times but i brought the smaller one so hey let's get to unboxing all right y'all so see all this loose stuff right here this is what i bring these big tubs for because we can go in there grab all this loose stuff real quick pack it in these that roll uh small stuff that like we don't want to put back in a box maybe more valuable gold silver stuff like that i'll throw it in here uh, so let's get set up first guys with how we're going to process this unit again this is way different than back in the day uh, back in the day we used to take trash everything back to the warehouse or to the house and go through it now we do the whole process here take the good stuff home take the other stuff straight to the dump we find that works best and it gives you less clutter and if you notice over the last probably few months we're just getting more and more organized uh, the more that me and gina do this on our own without employees uh, but it's working out really well so let us get cleaned up we're gonna pop some boxes up here y'all and we are about to look at me <laughs> so <clears throat> if you haven't seen the last video go check out last night's video y'all bomb.com unit <clears throat> so we've been through what maybe two boxes yeah hardly. maybe two boxes the first box we opened had easily 1500 in it in coins gold and silver coins uh we found two boxes with jewelry i left the box of jewelry at home y'all i opened a box of jewelry and it had like five gold bracelets uh 
what do you call them tennis bracelets tennis bracelets gold necklaces couple gold rings i mean we found a lot of gold jewelry so anyway that was in one box but i left it at the house so i'll have to show you that later so anyway let us get all of this little loose bags and stuff picked up uh look at these oh i can actually use these for my studio Mm -hmm. yeah, oh, and the, the colored ones! Okay. I swear, I was just, just looking just online. I was just looking online <laughs> for these like three days ago because I'm, y'all, I'm building a real nice studio. It's gonna, like, I gotta go get all these wooden crates. I'm making a wall out of for the shelving and stuff. They're really cheap, but I needed this to for the background. So, all right, guys. So check it out. I've already got started. Gina was looking for a car. So here, come down here. So I set up my, my trash bag. I wish I would have brought my rolling trash can. I really enjoy that. It just makes it go faster. So basically what I'm doing is, is I'm opening a box, putting all the trash stuff in here, and any sellable stuff like this stuff I'll give to, or sell that here in. Uh, look, there's like a train whistle, some signs and stuff like that. So any sellable stuff I'll put there, any single lot items we're gonna take back to the house that go in the auction, and we'll sell that stuff to Adrian. So that's kind of the process of what I'm doing right now. Here's a new one. Looks like mostly Christmas, so I'm gonna throw a lot of this stuff away. That's a nice picture. All right, we'll check that out, see if we find any etching on it. Um, let me clear something up, y'all. This is not my wedding ring. Not my one that <laughs> Gina bought me. It's one I found in a storage unit that was sitting in the garage, but it had diamonds in it, so I was like, I'll just pop that on till later. So look, here's some old Chris, oh, here's some Kiss stuff we saw through the box. Look, Chris, uh, Kiss uh, Christmas ornaments. Yep. Yeah, these are fun. These were 10 bucks a piece when they came out. Okay, so we got a couple of those. And look, I'm going to keep this stuff because, look, this is all new in the box stuff. Yep. I'm going to throw the loose lights away and stuff. I don't know. These Aren't these cute? Those are very cute. Those these are, are old. very cute, yeah. yeah. So, like look, that. this stuff, International Santa Claus Collection. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, from Germany. Okay, so cool deal. All right, so we'll pick all the trash out of this as well. He's kind of dingy. What do you think? Mm, yeah, look, his hat's broke. Yeah, his hat's okay, so he goes in the trash. Like, so we just we're not keeping trash. All these ribbons, stuff like this, we'll trash. And then, actually, I think all these loose ones we're gonna probably yeah. trash too, just because it's not the right time of year. But I'm definitely keeping these for sure. Cause look, I know. Isn't that cute? That's so cute. I like that one. All right, guys, so Gina found us a cart, and so I wasn't filming, but I was going through boxes. So let me show you what I found in those boxes real quick, and then we'll continue to do it together, guys. So I can't stress enough, y'all. Y'all got to check all the boxes. Even if you open it up and it looks like trash or says pictures and stuff, because I just found all this stuff in a box that was underneath um, stuff. So this is some um, 23 karat gold trading card limited of 20000 and it's actually still sealed. That's pretty cool. Emmett Smith, camera, some 3D lg glasses these are playing cards they're still sealed in there you know it comes with a little tin right. union That's pacific good. train stuff i guess um oh and this was just in there random box of pictures more coins oh wow <laughs> proof set um he spent 82 dollars on this box but look we got more coins okay uh, i don't know what is that Okay, I thought that was going to be like a dollar bill or something. Okay, so look. So we have more coins already, guys. I am not worried about this because the last two units, the one I pretty much gave to Adrian and everything, it's already been paid for. The stuff's at home. I mean, oh, yeah. We've already found a couple thousand in gold already, in, in coin, not including the coins. So I think we're probably already up to like almost $4,000 of profit on this unit. Check it out. All right, this one says Fragile Granny's Fiesta Mixing Glass, y'all. I've seen like four boxes that say Fiesta. If this is the old original Fiesta, y'all, I'm telling you, it's going to be all it is. Look. All right, so we're not unwrapping this for sure, but I can already tell. Let's go ahead and cut one. Yeah, so look. Genuine Fiesta. Okay. Uh, so we got blue in here. What else? Oh, look, babe. This is going to be so great. I'm not unpacking this box, y'all. Uh, look, this is Fiesta too, I bet. So it's, it's going to be the serving dishes as well. That's glass. Look down in here. So we'll have to unwrap all this back at the house because I'm definitely not doing it here. But if I had to guess, <clears throat> I'd say this is easily a $250 box. Easy. So this one says cake pans. These are the kind of cake pans I'm always finding in thrift stores, I'm hoping. You know what I'm talking about? Like yeah, the old cartoon ones. But I've seen probably like 10 pans that say cake, or 10 boxes that say cake pans. So but these do sell 
and look they are there's some of the figural ones here's the santa one look we got bunt cakes this lady was a cake maker yep okay so this isn't a lot of the figures the cartoons ones but this is all look you know bunt and stuff like that so this is actually the stuff that adrian can make pretty decent money on but next we got fragile we got fiesta wear a clock and a weather thing I always wanted a weather thing. I hope they mean a weather bane. Yeah, no. That would be cool. Let's pop in here. We're not gonna unwrap this. Look, is this more Fiesta and stuff? Yeah. Oh my cool. gosh, y'all, look. Okay. More Fiesta, look, here's small bowls. Stuff down here. Okay, a little smaller like cereal bowls or something. Let's just double check. Pop one open. Yeah, look, they did this and they, yeah, Fiesta. Yep. Okay. Uh, I kind of wanted to see what the clock was. Looks like here's the clock. So what we might do. Ooh, is this older? We'll cut where the glass is so we don't scrape the wood. Okay. Oh wow, this is it's electric. It's kind of fun. Okay, look, this, this is like some kind of like maybe a mantle or a desktop. There's mm -hmm. a winder on it. Uh the oh it's a chippendale grandfather clock oh, that's, cool. that's kind of fun okay so that'll be in the next auction all right y'all every time i see these i want to do this what movie Why? was that in? i don't know, I don't know. <laughs> it's a movie maybe when i was a kid or something i don't know that's almost my cup size too it sure is hold on let's see yeah all right y'all check it out so this is uh fiesta keep this stuff i'll throw this actually i'll throw that in adrian stuff you can sell it but look here's a galileo uh thermometer so I'm not gonna take that out of the bubble wrapper. That these are definitely good sellers. Dude. All right, we're gonna keep going. Show them. We're just going straight down the line with you guys. No discrimination. We're gonna let you see in every box. Uh, just because it's kind of fun to, to be in the. the uh, see a lot of this cake stuff in here. I'm gonna throw away. So this tub right here, what I'll probably do is just take like the figural ones out. Usually these have dates on them. Yeah. Yeah, so this is a 1987 Wilton oh, that's cool. uh, Halloween thing. So a lot of these aluminum pans, what I'm going to do is just take this. I'm going to cherry pick this. Because mm -hmm. um, Avery doesn't want all of this stuff. So this is... Are you gone? Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Look, this is a dirty tool thing. But look, there's saws in here. Here's a skill saw. Oh, man. Hey, what movie does this remind you of? Um, the Wizard of Oz. Yeah, boy. Can't get a little oil in it. I know. <laughs> he said his mouth. The other side. My goodness. I can talk again. All right, guys, I'm going to leave all this stuff for Adrian. Look, big tools, shears, yeah. stuff like that. There's a saw in there, screws, wrenches, stuff like that. So I'm going to pop the lid on this. Definitely an Adrian thing because he can take this to the to the uh, flea market, market, throw the tools out there, they'll buy them. All right, y'all, house shoes and winter clothes. By the weight of it, I'm going to say she's telling the truth. Yeah. <laughs> Leo. Oh, Leo. Hey, guys, uh, for all the stuff that y'all saw in that unit that I picked for Leo with all the cool advertising and stuff, that stuff's actually going to be in our next auction. He's going to combine it with ours, uh, so make sure to read through all the instructions. Uh, but that the Kool-Aid and the Tang advertising and stuff like that will be in the next auction. All right, y'all. So these look brand new. They've still got the thing on them. Secret Treasures, huh? You know that was my nickname in high school? What Secret Treasure? Secret Treasure. Can't tell you who gave it to me because I give away the secret. Okay, look at this. Looks like maybe personal stuff. Yeah, look, vacation, stuff like that. So look, this is trash, but we're gonna, I started a, a whole section of personal right here. This is all pictures, stuff like that. Change it up a little bit. Let's just come in here. Look, this is all Christmas stuff, electronic stuff. That's exactly what all of this stuff is. Uh, so we'll just keep this in here. We'll uh, maybe if we get the warehouse, like I'll start a Christmas section where we can put it back for you know to like at least like July. We got more cake decorating stuff. It's what it is. 
take this stuff because some of these pans can be worth. Look, these are Paula Dean cake pans. We're gonna have little chocolate molds. See if I can put a date on that. Uh, so anyway, actually, I think this stuff will be really good for Adrian. I'm gonna tell Adrian all this cake stuff. Yeah. Because he should be able to make good money on this. All right, y'all, made a big dent. Check it out. All right, we made took a couple loads. So look, these are the boxes I'm talking about. Completely good sellable stuff like this. Like, yep. yeah, this is good sellable stuff. Look, here's binoculars. These are gonna go with us as long as they have all the pieces. pieces. A lot of time the eye. Oh man, still got those are actually really clean. Yeah, those are nice. Okay, so look, we got some look, a bunch of baseball cards. Okay, so we'll put all this stuff back in here. Look, see, this is what I'm talking about. Look, that's a Seiko. Yeah, I mean, it ain't a, a ton nice of money, but that's an old Seiko mm -hmm. right there. Another camera. Um, look, little baby boots. Yeah. Oh, these little baby Justin boots. <laughs> They're trash, though. Um, okay. I'm trying to go through little by little. Sharp calculators, those sell. Y'all see all this little stuff? I love tubs like this. Because you could be looking at like four or five hundred bucks in this thing. Look at that lighter. Sorry. I'm moving fast. Now. You are moving I'll, fast. I'll slow down. Okay. Oh, look, is that a knife? With our compliments. Yeah, a little knife. Okay. Look. Knife. Oh, here's a Winchester. A little uh, belt knife. Uh, this is like some kind of video game. Oh, it's a memory card for PlayStation 2. Uh, what's that, an old MP3 player? See, look at all this. This is just money. This is little money down here, y'all. Yeah. Look, collectible stuff. Look at that old camel lighter. It's silver plated. Uh, look. Oh, oh that's, that's so cute. Cub Scouts. Okay, so, oh, look at this. Got the Weenie Mobile. Is that a whistle? You remember the whistles? Yeah, I know. The look, this is such a good little tub. Look at all these little goodies. All these little Hot Wheels and stuff I'm going to take out. That's a, no, that's a Boy Scout uh, tie thing. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah, that's old. Yep. Uh, so, we, look, we got cars. See, this is exactly, guys, why I bring these. I'm sitting here like, where am I going to put all this stuff? Okay, so look. Let's look how all this stuff just adds up in here. You know what I mean? Seiko watches, stuff that's like, you know, 10, 20, you know, 30, 40 bucks. Uh, all this stuff. Little collectible stuff. It just sells. It adds up. So, I mean, I'm thinking in here, there's probably a couple hundred bucks, you know. Yeah, after, yeah. after you piece it out, the lighters, the knives, uh, the Boy Scout stuff. All right, y'all, I'm about to call Adrian and see if he wants to come out here. Um, because these tubs are going to fill up. Like, that's another little camera. Uh, but look at all this stuff. Craftsman wrenches. Uh, man, this is a really... I might have to take this tub home. Yeah. Because, look, you pass up... Like, that's an old bottle opener. That's an old cast iron bottle opener. That's kind of cool. So we've seen a PlayStation piece. A Wii, a Wii controller. Good sign, huh? Yep. Is that like a puzzle? That's I wonder a, if they were green. Oh, no, look, that's another knife, babe. Yeah, Intech. Yeah, that's Intech. It's like a, eh, that's like a frost. Maybe a little bit. I mean, it's not great, but it's. It's all right. Yeah, you're right. Uh, memory card for the PlayStation. Oh, look at this. More coins. Y'all, I feel feeling we're gonna find. Oh, look, we're gonna find coins all through this thing. Okay. I found so many good coins. Oh, y'all, I found a thing of 1989, I think D double stamped where it looks like the 89 was stamped over 83 maybe but i found a couple of those and it's looking like they might be valuable y'all look those up for me yeah this is camel y'all look at that that is oh that's wild look at that isn't that crazy i never seen something like that it's got the camel signal that's like a cool lot right there i don't even know what that'll go for